trick. Robbie Keane, yes! The Los Angeles Galaxy are the first to five. It's a wonderful feeling knowing that there's two teams left standing and we're the team hosting here at a place that we feel very confident and comfortable in. El ambiente es lindo. Que volver a vivirlo. Y, y estaba cerca la semana, estaba cerca, un poquito de nerviosismo. Ya como el miércoles, ya un poquito así como la sensación de que wow, ya el partido viene. This really is one of those I was there days. It's a real privilege to be here. So glad you could join us at the Stop Hub Center in Southern California. A picture perfect Southern California afternoon. Will it be a picture perfect ending for LD10 as Landon Donovan pulls the curtain down on his career? The Galaxy carry the gravity of heavy favorites while the revolution's underdog status has served them just fine to get here so often though finals pay no heed to form will this one stick to the preordained script or go off on a different tangent we're about to find out mls cup 2014 underway with the revolution in their dark blue going from left to right the galaxy all in white. He is on the ball. And bursting into the penalty area. Rogers. Could it be a brilliant start? Oh, it's a deflection and off the line. Fantastic balls here, which Wynn is trying to sign with that little dinked ball. Well, this is Charlie Davies off and running. The uh, sliding challenge. Robbie Keane. Time to bring it down, set out his sights, set out his stall, and Ali drove it right into the frame of Bobby Shuttleworth. If you underestimate New, New England, I think so, small bit. Once we beat Seattle and, and Salt Lake, the f one of the favourites, if you like, we thought maybe this you know, could be an easier game, I suppose, and it certainly wasn't. I think finals are always kind of hectic, especially early in the games. Everyone's trying to test out their opponents, um, fill the game out a little bit. Two teams that are very good defensively, and I think it showed throughout you know, that entire first half. Goalless after 45 minutes between the Los Angeles Galaxy and the New England Revolution. Chances very much at a premium. feel about it since the break. Ishizaki swinging it in, Zardes, Giassi Zardes, can he do it? Yes he can! How sweet it is for the hometown hero from Hawthorne, California, Giassi Zardes for the Galaxy. It, it felt amazing, not even just the crowd, you know, my family, we're in the stands, you know, like I always say, this is our dream, I'm living. It was just so wonderful just to score in, in my hometown, in front of my friends, in front of my family, and most of all, in front of all these amazing fans. Jesse hadn't scored a goal in a couple of months, so he, he was having a little bit of a rough patch there, and uh, it, it was great to see he, he could come out of it and, and, and get such an important goal, and a goal which uh, should have been a, the winning goal in the game.
Mullins suddenly popping out into the penalty area. Good cut back to Christiani for the revolution has scored! What about that? The man who stood at Gillette Stadium and cried when the revolution lost to LA over a decade ago has just equalized. Unbelievable. Finals are never always perfect. And I think it was a culmination of a long year, a long playoff run for us uh, and probably for them too, where I think you had two teams that never got into a great flow. Clearly on our end, a team that prides itself in possession and ball movement, I don't think it was clean. Um, and it became one of those games where it was going to be a one play or two play game. We're in the little the huddle at the, at the end there. <clears throat> After the 90 minutes when players are getting shaken off and getting quick massage and Omar, he, was, he looked a bit he looked a bit tense. He said, oh, I can't remember what he said to me. I said, don't worry, we'll, we'll get a chance. I'll, I told him I'll score. Don't worry, I'll score. I'll get a chance, I'll score. Now Keane, Blanker stayed down. Robbie Keane, yes! The Keane killer instinct is still razor sharp. And he gives the Galaxy the lead. sounds the Los Angeles Galaxy are the first to five and Donovan gets his ideal swan song he goes out a champion you know, obviously the emotion of the, the entire year was all into that one whistle uh, we were we were done for the year uh, Landon went off you know being an MLS Cup champion uh, his last game ever uh, everything this group has been through together. Uh, you know, obviously the passing of Luca and uh, how everyone came together then uh, was tremendous. And you know, at the end of the game, just all, all emotions at that point. I think it's a real honor to be able to play with Landon. He's going to go down in history as one of the greats. And um, I think just realizing that now is important. You know, and I, I just wanted to thank him. You know, I didn't. I wanted to tell him to his face, you know, how much he meant to me and how much I've learned from him and how much I respect him, you know, and and I wished him well and on his next journey. And um, and that was special for me. I think it was a storybook ending with, you know, Landon retiring and sending him off the right way and Robbie Keane getting MVP and you know, it was just great for everyone around. It was a tough game and well it wasn't the greatest game. Wasn't the prettiest game, probably wasn't the best game to watch on TV. But ultimately it doesn't matter because people remember what they remember is now the LA Galaxy of the Champions again. The whole day is just a big blur now almost because you're so happy after the game and getting that trophy and getting that medal. Uh, it was just an amazing feeling and yeah, the whole day is just like a big happy blur. <laughs> That's always a good moment, you know, the, the build up to it, we're waiting for Landon, everybody's ready. You know, some champagne bottles start going off on their own because they're all shook up. So um, once he came in, it just, it was, it was on. We were all just going for it, you know, spraying each other, drinking, and just uh, letting loose. And that's what it's all about, man. Just all that hard work just comes out and, and it's a celebration. You know, and, and you celebrate with the guys that you work hard with and that know that know the ins and outs of a long season. And it was a lot of fun, a lot of fun.